Oh, Mr. Carson, Colonel Baird, the other librarians are closed! I know, Captain Spinner one step ahead the entire time. Man. But now I have an ace up my sleeve. Oh, good. What's that? You. Uh, come. Yes, sir. I mean, let's reminisce for a while. Now, was it the summer of 67? No, no, 68, when we first met. Do you remember? Mr. Carson, what are we doing? Death has been feeding off of librarian energy, and you better need to amount. Yes, yes, you're an immortal. You get a lot of juice. Fill her up. One overload coming up. Uh-huh. Yes. <clears throat> Flint! You saved me. You defeated Gethic. Because I saved my friends. They called us. Ah. Well, once their creator was defeated, they returned to dust. And... Gooey bits. Uh, Mr. Dare, I have managed to reverse engineer the portal accelerator that Gethic designed. It should be good for a one-time, one-way trip back to 1888. Thank you, Galahad. My honor and pleasure to serve you one last time, sir. We will not meet again, but it feels good to live my life knowing that someday you'll read about it. I dare you, don't you? Um, tomorrow, when you go back, uh, on your birthday, have a really great day. Have a great birthday. I will. Thank you. Ahoy, ahoy. Ahoy, ahoy. It's, uh, tomorrow, he died. No. Wait, Flynn. Come and look at this. Look, it, it's changed. He doesn't die tomorrow. Something in his outlook shifted and he reconnected with his friends. They spent his birthday with him, and when he was attacked, they stood by him and defended him. He, he lived to fight another day. Ah, uh, plenty more days. Look, he lived another 62 years. This was after he retired, he died. At the age of 102. Ha! Dare to dare! <laughs> Says here his final words were, I have no regrets. I look forward only to the adventures yet to come. Sounds like a win-win, buddy. <laughs>